weekend festival uh, starts on a Friday and continues to Saturday night. We usually show you a documentary with a short, or we show you a feature with a short, or we show you maybe five or six shorts in that time schedule. East Lansing and the Saginaw Film Festival, well, you only get to see one movie, and you pay for that one movie. And we figure that the people should be able to see what they want to see, and I think it's a great price for like five dollars. I've had three movies that I've submitted to film festivals or film contests. The awards we have, we give them for the best feature, short, made in Michigan film, high school film, and audience choice award. Some of the film festivals I've been to have been organized very well. They sent you a letter letting you know that you, your video made it into their, their festival. And then two weeks later, they send you a thing letting you know who the winner was. And then when you got there, they handed out like two checks at the beginning and no awards to anybody. Then they screened all the movies and then nothing. <laughs> like nobody came out to like thank you or say hi. We have an after party to introduce all the filmmakers, the directors, the actresses, and they can tell you such great stories, even just making the movies. This year we had a writer that came in that did screenplays. The year before we had a makeup artist. We had a panel of just the filmmakers that came in from around the country. I, I love being part of the panel. All the way through everything I've been doing, there's always been people that I could talk to and people that would help me out. So it's good to be able to return that favor and help other people. You know, the, the best way to make movies is, is to start making movies. You learn from doing, you know, but if I can talk to somebody who's done it before, maybe I can avoid some of the mistakes that they've made along the way. It's a new experience for people. Go to the movie show and they see the ones that you have, the commercial movies. But it's not the same as coming to an independent film festival. Basically like going to a more passionate movie. Like you buy a ticket to go to the theaters and watch a movie, but you never get to meet the people that are actually in the movie. Every time you watch a different film, and it is so interesting, and if people can't see what it is to have an independent film, just to come out and say, hey, I seen this movie, and their word spreads to somebody else. You know, going to a film festival, it's a whole weekend usually of filmmaking. You know, so you not only get to watch a movie, or actually quite a few movies, you know, usually for the price that it takes you to go to one movie at a theater. You get to go to the movies, and you get to meet the people that were in the movies, the people that made the movies. You know, it's a, it's a, almost like watching a bonus disc but actually being there. Flint is redeveloping, really regrowing. And with all the young students that are, are here now, I think it's a big, big thing that we have this Flint Film Festival. Because with the young group, they are seeing what we can do and showing these new films. And a lot of young people, if they come to our film festival, will maybe say, hey, I can make a movie. I can do that. Maybe I can be an actor. Maybe I can be a screenwriter. It gives them hope. And I think that is great that we're doing this at the Flint Film Festival.